Now at this point you would have recorded your narration for all of the slides and you should take the playhead back to the beginning and just watch the whole presentation and make sure it's how you want it. Notice like some of these gaps I have, I could actually click on this audio and shorten up that part that didn't have any talking on it so that it can be nice and tight with no breaks no pauses because as somebody's watching this they don't want lots of long pauses so as you do that that might also require you to shorten the the frames that you had from before but once you've got that all ready how you want it then you need to publish it because right now no one can watch this unless they can sign into we video on your account we want to make a video that they can watch so the way that you publish is to click here and when you first click that it will ask you to title your video if you haven't already and I'm just going to call mine sample video and then click set now there are a few things to remember on this page first of all make sure that Google Drive is in color if it's like this it's not going to save to your drive so make sure it's in color that it's selected I usually pick 720 HD since it's free and it's high resolution that's the best we don't want these to be public on the web so I'll turn that to private and then you will click publish video but when this page comes up it might stay at zero percent for a long time if you read this down here you'll notice that it doesn't matter you can actually close your browser and it doesn't matter because this this is being processed at we video and when it's done it will show up in your Google Drive it won't show up right away it might take a while to show up there in fact sometimes it takes hours but as long as you select a drive on that publish page it will eventually show up there okay I've waited some time after I published and I did notice that in Google Drive my video is there remember I called it sample video it didn't show up here right away I actually had to search for it I had to type in sample video sometimes there are other files created by we video and you have to make sure that you are selecting your actual video so notice that the icon looks like this it has a play button if you are looking at your drive with larger icons you can see clearly that it has a play button and this is the video that we created now if you right click on that or do a two finger tap on the Chromebook you can share that and you need to share that with your teacher so share that with the teacher and if you want to you can put my address in there too just M Petty, and you'll see it show up and then we will have a copy of that video so we can see the presentation that you created